Hi, I'm Mike Vernack, Program Manager for Rockwell's Legacy DCS Migration Program. What we do within the program is we build tools and engineering capability to help migrate legacy DCS systems to our modern DCS called Plant PAX. I'd like to show you a number of tools that we offer today to migrate these systems. This is a more APAC system here. What we've done here is we've developed a number of interfaces to communicate directly to the more APAC system, pull information out of the APAC system, and send it directly to a control logic controller. With that, we're able to communicate peer-to-peer -peer with the existing APAC system, as well as to be able to connect directly to the Plant PX system natively through control logic tags. We also have developed I.O. scanners for the same system where we can deploy the system, recontrol the I.O. Um, through this module, controlling it with control logic uh, processors. We can eliminate the more APAX controller with this module. This device is a termination unit for more APAX called the Marshall Termination Assembly. Imagine all of these terminations um, full of instrumentation wiring. And when we went to cut over a lot of I.O., you would have to unterminate these terminations, re-terminate with a new um, a Rockwell termination unit. What we're offering here is a cable solution that allows these terminations to stay intact. We would pull the, the Apex uh, I.O. cable from their system and we would plug in a Rockwell cable that allows us to cut this system out very quickly, plug directly into a Rockwell I.O. module, and allow a very fast cutover. The faster we can get the systems cut over, the faster we can get uh, the, uh, the customer back in production. This is also a similar solution for the Honeywell system. We offer these for 10 or 12 different DCS platforms today. What I'd like to show here is an, an I.O. scanner for the Honeywell IPC620 PLC. It's a, a largely obsolete system today, not supported well. And we are able to cut this I.O. rack out. This is a remote I.O. rack very quickly by connecting with this I.O. scanner module here. And again, recontrolling the, the, uh, the process with Rockwell. Okay, I recently released this wiring solution here where you can take the I.O. out very quickly by un, um, unmounting or taking these swing arms away from the I.O. modules, pulling this rack out, placing this base module in its place, snapping two adapter modules that you can see here onto a DIN rail and then cabling over to a Control Logix I.O. It allows for very fast cutover. Um, we have a number of these solutions for PLCs as well. You can get that information by going on rockwellautomation.com slash migrations and for more information and downloads.